Hey, what's up, YouTube? This your girl Gigs. Um, I'm already at it. <laughs> Meaning, I already hit the blunt. You know, it is what it is. That's just how I do it. I wouldn't even be myself if I got on here and act any other way. You know. Um, the reason for this video is I said I was gonna leave the whole thing alone. And to be honest, I do have a little bit more to say. But I am gonna, you know, gonna keep it cordial on this video and just leave it at that. This is actually my last video. Uh, the purpose of this video is I want to apologize to the ones that are new subscribers and the ones that just don't know why in the hell did I, you know, did the last cigarette tires. Um... I'm a very detailed person, and if I'm not mistaken, I think I went into details of why I did do the Cigarette Diaries as well as the last video. Um, I hate to be repetitive and repeat myself, but it was a reaction video. You might say it was three months, but it was actually last month. If you look at... Uh, you know, let me let me just try to give them some views. And you might think I'm petty and childish for even seeing that. So be it. I'm not feeling myself. I don't have a big head. And I, like I said, I'm not bashing anyone. I'm just reacting off of a video that I saw that you guys may not have seen. Because the video was deleted. Around July, I think. 8th or 9th, if I'm not mistaken, I told you guys that I was leaving BBW TV 1. That was last month, if I'm not mistaken, because this month is August. Although some people want to say it was three months ago or whatever. I'm just saying, real, recognize real. If you want to do the research, you can go back and see when did I leave BBW TV 1. When did I let you guys know that I left? It was in July last month. Um, after I left, later on down the line, I did a video on answering some questions that you know you guys wanted to know about BBW TV One and why I left. I actually answered those questions for you guys. I don't remember the date on that, but it had to be the middle of July. After I did that video. Red Diamond did a response video. Yes, she did a response video. It wasn't a, a video that was public. It was only a video for listed people, the people that she wanted to see the video. Some people already told me they did see the video. I know that I'm not crazy, but there was a video that was deleted like in the middle of July. If you don't know, July 26th, my brother got killed. I hate to bring it up, but yes, my brother got killed on July 26th. I wasn't really feeling like fucking with the videos at all. Didn't really, really give a damn about what was going on here on YouTube. So... I didn't touch bases. I didn't respond. I didn't do my response video. About time when it was time for me to do a response video, the video was deleted. Red Diamond's video. So you guys could say it was three months even though it was last month. I don't care. It doesn't matter. I just came here to clear up some shit. I did my response video because there was some sneak dissing in that video. It was some sneak dissing, meaning that a person didn't have a nerve to say exactly what they want to say. They just beat around a bush and pussyfoot around the whole subject and just sneak diss some shit. That's what snakes do. Unfortunately, gigs. It's not a person that sneak this. I am humble. 
I am kind. You can go back to all of my other videos. I don't start drama. Every time that I have to curse somebody out and get out of character, it's because somebody came at me. Or maybe I'm just being real, you know. But you can call me fake. You can call me a hater. But just because I said someone's name doesn't mean I'm a hater. It just means that I'm coming at that person directly. See, some people like to leave their subscribers in the dark. A lot of their subscribers be like, who is she talking to? They have to figure out what exactly that the person that they're subscribed to is saying and who exactly is they're coming at. You know, because they don't come straight out and say the person's name. They just pussyfoot around the whole subject. Unfortunately, gigs don't do that. I'm sorry. So I would not leave my subscribers nor my viewers in the dark. I'm coming at that person directly and let them know exactly how I feel and why I feel that way. Now you might think I'm childish, you might think it's drama, you might think I'm a hater or whatever. I don't really care. I already told you guys that if you feel like I was fake before my birthday, because Monday was my birthday. Monday was the day I realized that I had a partnership. If you think that I changed from Monday and so beyond, if you think five, six days ago that I'm different just because I got partnership, and you think that since I'm acting a different way, then unsubscribe. I already told you guys, unsubscribe. You feel me? I'm not asking you guys to stay here because I'm a fake person. If you really think that I'm a fake person, leave because I wouldn't follow no one as fake either. But um, if you think that out of 24 hours, I dedicate 20 minutes out of 24 hours to YouTube, that I'm lifeless, I have no life, unsubscribe. If you actually think I'm sitting here waiting on something to pop off so I can just attack or whatever or defend myself, leave. Now, I must admit, I don't handle situations like other people do. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people be like, gigs, act ladylike. Leave it alone. This ain't even you. That's out of your character. Actually, it's not out of my character. See me? I know how to be crazy. I know how to be serious. I know how to be professional. I know how to act a goddamn fool. I know how to be childish. I know how to be all these different people. I'm human. And I'm pretty sure you know how to be that way too. If someone stepped on your toe and you know they did it deliberately, would you actually just sit there and just be like, Oh gosh, she stepped on my toe. Or would you be like, Bitch, you stepped on my motherfucking toe. Maybe I won't use those type of words. But geeks, the way I grew up in the streets of Miami, that's the attitude I have. Like I said, I know how to be humble. I always been humble. I never came on here and started drama. But again, if you want to believe that that's me, that's my character, and I'm fake because I got partnership, leave. Do what you have to do. So be it. I'm just being me. I'm just being gigs. So I want to apologize to the ones that never seen that side of me. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to really apologize for that. But I'm not going to apologize for being myself. I mean, I'm not a puppet. I'm not on here every day. I do have a life. Just because I dedicated 20 minutes, well, to be honest, I just got the privilege to dedicate 20 minutes because, okay, I got partnership. But before, I only had 10 minutes. And then, like, later on, they did up the minutes to 15 minutes. So just because I dedicated 10 to 15 minutes, let me just be real, 10 to 20 minutes to YouTube out of 24 hours, that doesn't mean I don't have a life. I have a life. I just know how to react on certain things. Again, there was a video that you guys did not see. And although a person choose to come at me indirectly, I'm going to come at that person directly. 
And I'm not going to apologize about how I reacted um, on the last videos at all. If I said it, then I mean it. And it's still going to stick and stay. I'm not going to delete it. Unfortunately, you guys can't even go and look at the video that I'm reacting on because it's deleted. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I did say it in enough detail for you to understand why I'm reacting the way I'm reacting. But, you know, you can't really pass judgment on nobody by just listening to one person you know but you know i'm just glad i wasn't the only one who did see the video there's other people that did see the video as well and they know exactly what i'm talking about but um i do apologize for bringing this all up and showing the side of me that happens to come out i'm only human we all have different mood swings and don't tell me that if somebody step on your toes you're not going to react the way that i react i don't care if you're the most ladylike person in the world you know what i'm saying you're gonna have to cross that bridge when you get there and get out of your character that's just how it is so um i don't apologize for none of that i just apologize for you know my subscribers and my viewers for seeing me lash out like that you know but um black and thick never did anything to me only thing i did was call her out call it the way i see it you know my grandmother always said you're not supposed to listen out for the loud snakes don't worry about the rattles and shit it's the quiet snakes that you got to look out for because the quiet ones are the deadliest ones believe me and she instigated the whole thing from facebook to youtube so that's just the way i see it uh rachel rachel whatever her name is she was the one who actually was calling people fat bitches and shit on the um on a video and i just figured that it's all in one you know what i'm saying it's all in one a bird of a feather flock together so you know all of y'all snakes and that's just how i feel now i'm gonna continue on to feel that way but it doesn't matter to me how you live your life trying to say that you're more educated than me I can pull out scholarships and all this other shit too but that's just high schoolish right there you know what I'm saying but like I said I'm still gonna be gigs before and after the partnership I apologize guys for dropping it on you like this and I'm done with this whole situation so on to the next hair video on to the next makeup video and as far as this whole speech issue that she said I am a Miamian this is how we talk down south in Miami I'm very educated don't even need to like show you proof or anything because it don't even matter and just because I dedicated 10 to 20 minutes out of a 24 hour day by day schedule to YouTube doesn't mean I don't have a life this is just 10 to 20 minutes what do you think I do in the other 23 hours and 40 minutes? Live. It's called life. But this is your girl, Gage. I'm out.